Welcome to the Oakley Arctic Challenge, a six-star ticket to ride world tour slope style event with 100,000 US dollars in the prize pot. First up, the women's final. The women competing in the Oakley Arctic Challenge for the first time ever. And now Jamie Anderson from the USA, one of the favorites for this year's challenge. She opened on that first row with a nicely done nose slide, style for miles. He's in the cannon rail now with a lofty backside 180 mute out of the rail. Landing switch, setting up for the first jump. Now entering that first jump with lots of speed, doing a huge and stylish switch backside 540. Perfect, this is by far the best we've seen so far. Next, the step up. Backside 360 mute, keeping the flow judges impressed. Finally, a front side tail slide 270 out on the rail. That was perfect. Now it will be decided who will be in the lead as Jamie's about to hit her last element. And it's a backside 540 big. And we have a new leader. The question will be by how much. She's obviously happy with her run, as she should be. And here's the replay. Uh, Jamie gets 9.5 out of 10 on the cannon rail. The same score from the judge on the first jump. That is looking good. The other highlight on element five, Jamie gets 10 points out of 10. Unbeatable. 49.4 points from the trick judges and 38 points out of 40 from the flow judges. Jamie Anderson takes the lead by almost 20 points. This will be the one to beat. The last contender, Spencer O'Brien from Canada. This event, an opportunity to up her season's best after fifth place at the Burton New Zealand Open earlier this season. She hit that first rail with a nice and fluent front side lip slide. Conditions looking good. In the air with a drop of Crowl out on the cannon rail. O'Brien shows good flow so far. And to the kicker, a big backside 360. Gets the landing well, but has to adjust with her arms before it. And now the step up. And that is a very nicely executed frontside 540. Note she takes off from a toe edge, making it more difficult. And then switched around to a regular direction. She did that 50-50 to frontside 180 off on the rail. Finally, the last kicker. Switch, backside, 540, perfectly landed. Spencer happy with that, and with good reason. The question is, will the run be enough to top Jamie Anderson's score? We'll leave that one up to the judges. It's almost the same score as Jamie from the trick judges with a 48.7. Now it's up to the flow judges. 36.4 for flow, giving Spencer a total of 85.1. Second place, just 2.3 points behind Anderson. So it's Jamie Anderson of the US who wins the Oakley Arctic Challenge, and it's easy to tell why she's so happy.